Hey guys, welcome back to the channel. Thank you so much for clicking on this video and welcome to night number three out of my third annual 13 Nights of Fright. Tonight we're going to be talking about 2019's Little Monsters. Dave, who is this struggling musician, somebody who just got out of a serious but very toxic relationship, living with his sister and his little nephew and he ended up meeting Miss Caroline which is played by Lupita Nyong'o who is a teacher of the nephew and just so so very smitten and uh, decided to volunteer to escort them to their nice little field trip on the farm. Now Josh Gad plays Teddy McGiggles and he is like the children's like favorite person. He has like a little talking frog and he's just you know like the kid it hit show he sings he dances and all this other stuff um and he's uh, at the farm too just kind of doing like a surprise visit now this lovely farm is like i don't know like 50 miles i think it was from a military base so in this military base of course there is an outbreak that happens and we get zombies that is right we're talking about another zombie movie um now i remember when this movie came out and I was unsure about watching it. That's why I did not watch when it came out. So I was like, I don't know, it might be scary. I don't know. It has little kids. I honestly, I'm not gonna lie. I am not gonna lie. It's called Little Monsters, right? I thought that the children were gonna be zombies. So the whole Ding Dong movie, I'm just like, when are y'all going to die? And when are y'all gonna come up and go after your teacher? That's honestly what I thought. I just kept waiting for these kids to die or for one to die or one to get scratched and it affects everybody. But no, that didn't happen. So again, we're on a field trip, zombie outbreak at the military base, they end up at the farm, boom, outbreak, okay? And the funny thing is that apparently it's not the first outbreak because at one point it's like, oh, another zombie outbreak, what? At least they're slow this time. So yeah, they are slow zombies. Now, Miss Caroline, this is the type of teacher that you want your kids to have because she is on top of it. She's going to protect your children. She threatened Teddy McGiggles because Teddy McGiggles was a little asshole and he did not care about these children. He's like, I am fed up. I studied at, I don't know what school. I think he had like some training from Al Pacino. And so now he's like this character personnel, like for little kids that he's like, the only joy I have is to like sleep with the parents. Like that's his way of getting back at these demon children is to sleep with the parents. She will protect your children. She will put some little rose colored glasses on these kids and make them think like, hey, you know what? This is a game. Now, some people may argue that how is it that these kids didn't realize that they were the actual zombies, you know, that they weren't just pretending to play this game as the teacher let them know you know they're kids you know they are very innocent and they're not that's my me defending the kids you know they don't have that kind of mentality or whatever and that's that's kind of where i'm gonna go even though one of the kids is like yeah they're kind of like my game i do get some like blood and guts and stuff like the zombie stuff that i kind of like i kind of wish we had a little bit more of it i don't like that the animals were put in danger because again we we're like in a farm so we do see them you know like chomping up on some of these um animals i really want to know what the heck happened to this lamb because one of the kids was kind of doing something and like got the lamb and i don't know like did the lamb survive did he like throw the lamb to the zombies i really don't know i feel like this movie if you are like a hard type family and you have smaller uh kids that you're trying to introduce horror movies to them so that way they can you know start loving what you love and kind of you know getting them into seeing these kind of movies this could be a movie that you could put in there because it's it's not too heavy it has some gore in it where you would still enjoy the gore to it and the zombie stuff with it but it's not like overly i feel like traumatizing where oh yeah my kid is it's just too much before i do give you my score if you haven't already don't forget to give this video a like subscribe to the channel if you haven't yet don't forget to hit the notification bell so you'll be notified each time i post something new that way you don't miss the remaining 10 days of fright and uh yeah with all that said i'm going to give little monsters a medium popcorn i think it was still a pretty good time it's not one of my absolute favorite zombie movies and it's not really one that i would add to the rotation but if you definitely have somebody who you're maybe trying to introduce into the genre of horror i think like this is a nice little step forward if you know they're coming from something like even lighter this could be like the next step into it to kind of get a little bit more of that little gorish zombie stuff to it because again there is a little bit there's not a lot but 
you do get the hordes of zombies and everything um, happening there. If you've seen little monsters, let me know down below. What did you think about it? Did you like it? Did you love it? Did you hate it? Was it just not for you? And that is it for me tonight. I'll see you guys tomorrow. Bye.